because I refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up, Barry. And it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt wins. Right, the bouncer's guilt wins. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. Oscar Bovis, IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Obviously, you boys are happy, but I'm happy because I feel like we spoke about this. Okay. We've done joint interviews. I've interviewed you both on your fight nights individually. Now it's two in the same night with two stoppages. Um, whichever one of you want to go first, what night? It's a dream come true, true, to be honest, mate. Um, we've, we've talked about this since young kids. Uh, it's one we've ticked off now. You know, uh, we're, we're buzzing, we're buzzing. Obviously, you've just stepped out the ring. Um, we'll talk about your stoppage first. A really credible opponent with a winning record. You moved to 9-0 and now. Um, yeah, everything's just looking really good around your career. Yeah, look, we, we work so hard in the gym, it's, um, and that's why it looks good under the lights because how much work we do put in. And uh, like you said, this kid was—he had a winning record. He's dangerous. He's never been dropped, never been stopped. Um, me and Ben knew what we were going to do today. To be honest, we've been saying it to everybody. Uh, obviously, talk is talk, but we showed we can do it today. And now we want to keep pushing on and, and keep showing what we can do. Yeah. I did see a little bit of your interview with BT, and you spoke about titles. You're at that stage now. Um, obviously, that was a good win tonight. You've done your learning phase where you fight them kind of journeyman survivor people. Is the next step for you either a big domestic fight or a fight where you can get a strap around your waist? Yeah, look, I'm not really looking at any people. Um, there's no one there that I particularly want to point out or name. I just want titles. So really, whoever's got the titles, that's who I want. Like, they're the fights I want. Um, I'm going to leave it to Martin and Frank. Uh, they'll, they'll, they'll point me in the right direction. And yeah, like we said, we'll do our job and, and I'll get them titles. And for you, well... Two fights in a year. It's nice to kind of get that activity up. Two and knockouts. Exactly, two <laughs> knockouts as well. Is it nice to just kind of feel like you're an active fighter now? Because yeah. I know for so long there's been kind of little niggles and different things. You've been yearning to be an active fighter. Yeah. I have, yeah. This is... Couldn't ask much more, could I? Uh, coming back on March 25th, doing a six round, uh, getting a sixth round knockout, and then coming back today, doubling up with Carl, getting a first round knockout. You know, so I showed a bit of everything. Um, then doing two on the same show, two knockouts. Come on, man. I suppose there's some pretty easy conversations to be had now about keeping you guys on the same show. Yeah, look, that, we, we said um, we we said earlier we want to steal the show and we want to show why why we should be here. And uh, I think Frank's going to regret a little bit not putting Ben on the live TV. But uh, like we said, we have to, sometimes in life you have to earn it. And uh, I feel like he's earned it today. Who's more stressed out of you two? What would you both prefer? Do you prefer to be the one going first or... I can imagine it's right for you because you've got your job done, but then you're still thinking. Yeah, yeah. It's just as bad. It's, it, 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 they're just as bad as each other yeah. because I, I've got to focus on my fight, so I get out of the way, and he's obviously nervous for me. And then the roles reverse, yeah. so it's, yeah. it's just as bad as each other because it don't change. But just, you just got to stay relaxed, mate. It's just yeah. I, I know what you can do. So even when he was there. I tried not to waste any energy and just stay calm and watch him. But I said to him, that's what I said to him around the ring. I said, if you're gonna watch me, relax. I don't don't shout, don't jump up and down. Just relax. So yeah, he done that, and uh, yeah, I'm happy. because I refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up, Barry. And it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt wins. Right, the bouncer's guilt wins. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day.